Hello YouTube, this is another little problem called Qingsang, giving an array of integers, written indices of two numbers such that they add up to a specific target. You may assume that each input would have exactly one solution, and you may not use the same element twice. So we cannot use the same element uh, twice. It's like, if the target is 4, we cannot use 2, 2 twice. So for this example, target is 9. So we just output 2, 7. So let's do that. We can use a hash map to store all the elements. And then we loop over the whole array again. When we loop over uh, uh, 2, we need to check if target minus 2 existing in the hash map or not. So let's do that first and first. No, no, stop length equal to zero. We need a result array. That would be two. In this case, result, we could just give two negative one because we could not sign any. Just return results. Otherwise, we need a smash. Teacher, we loop over the whole array. I let's say plus stop length i plus plus. We just put it into the array. Key is the value of the element. Value is the index. So we loop the array again after we store all the elements to the hash map. So we need to check if hash map contains when we loop over length of i contains target minus length of i, and we need to make sure that uh, i is not equal to we cannot use the same element not equal to get target minus length of i. In that case, we now we found this tuple. Just give without zero i. Without the one for the hash map from get target minus length of i. If we found this combo or tuple, we just uh, break out. Finally, we Content target lungs. What's wrong here? If Contains key, okay, not contains. We run again. That worked, uh, submit. Okay, guys, that worked. Uh, for, okay, for this problem, there's another solution that you can, uh, because the input is not solid, you can just uh, sort this array and then use two pointer, one pointer from left to right and uh, the other pointer from from right to left uh, to loop over this array. Let me know if you have a uh, better, pro better solution. Thank you.